radio operators listening for enemy communications back in World War I heard something unexpected. What at first sounded like a chorus of birdsong at dawn turned out to be something way cooler. The strange sounds came from thunderstorms disturbing the Earth's magnetic field. Researchers later called these chorus waves. Chorus waves are tiny bursts of energy that ripple through the Earth's magnetic field. The waves zip along the curved magnetic field lines, which is what creates that signature chirp. But here's the twist. These waves don't just make cool sounds. They can also create something called killer electrons. These supercharged particles zoom around the Earth's magnetic field at nearly the speed of light and can be really dangerous for spacecraft and astronauts. So why are we talking about this now? Well, researchers previously thought that chorus waves only existed in a planet's magnetic field. So in theory, once you pass through the danger zone on your way to space, you wouldn't have to worry about killer electrons hurting you or your spacecraft. But scientists just found chorus waves way out in space, like 165,000 kilometers away from Earth, which is three times farther than it's ever been found before. This may mean that chorus waves and the killer electrons they create are much more common in space than we previously realized. And this could be a huge deal for future missions to the moon and Mars and beyond. So what's next? Well, scientists are working to better predict where and when the chorus waves happen so that astronauts and satellites can avoid their dangers. Chorus waves might sound beautiful, but they're really a reminder that space is full of perilous mysteries that we're just beginning to understand.